If you order one of these four VPS servers that you see in these boxes here, uh, you have the option to purchase it with a Windows license. And when you go to set up Windows uh, after the server has been deployed, there are a couple more steps that you have to take to actually gain access to your Windows machine. In this video, we're just gonna show you how to do that. So I go into the manager and I click on this bare metal cloud section. And then I just pick the VPS that I wanna finish the installation on. And we're gonna go next to the name and click on these three dots right here. We're gonna click KVM and it's gonna open this window. Uh, I'd recommend opening it in a new window just because this is obviously pretty small and can't be expanded. So we'll go ahead and do that. Now we're presented with options for uh, which home country slash region we want to pick, uh, what's your preferred app language, and what keyboard layout you want to use. If none of these apply to you, then go ahead and change them to your preferred settings. In our case, these are good. So we'll just go ahead and click Next. And now we're just going to go ahead and set an administrator password. So I will go ahead and do that real quick. And now it's just going to finalize our settings and our VPS is all set up.